Remember these guys? The Bling Ring. Rich kids from Los Angeles who were so infamous, a movie was made about their lives starring Emma Watson. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Now, a new bling ring may be in action, breaking into celebrity homes, taking $500,000 in jewels and clothes from Kevin Hart's mansion, and $50,000 cash from a safe at singer Chris Brown's house. Kevin was able to crack a joke about the break-in on the Steve Harvey radio show. They took a pair of my pants. What you gonna do with my pants? Anybody else gonna fit my pants? That's right. They took a pair of my jeans? Other recent victims include keeping up with the Kardashians reality star Scott Disick and 200 grand in cash and jewels from model Black China, who's engaged to Kim Kardashian's brother Rob. Here's Lisa Guerrero. The latest break-in at Kevin Hart's mansion behind those gates has cops wondering if this is a new bling ring targeting celebrity homes, just like the notorious gang that gained notoriety back in 2008. The last time around, the homes of Lindsay Lohan, Paris Hilton, Audrina Patridge, and Orlando Bloom were burglarized. This is surveillance tape of the original bling ring at work, grabbing a key from under a mat and entering Paris Hilton's home. So whatever happened to the original alleged bling ring leader, Rachel Lee, we asked crisis manager Wendy Feldman. Each person handled it differently. Rachel's goal was to change her life and put it behind her and get closer with her family and really look at what happened. By the way, the best known bling ringer, Alexis Nears, is now the mother of two children. In the end, being part of a bling ring isn't a good idea. The bottom line is, do they understand that there's going to be a consequence, that there's going to be a price? Thank you.